Ms. Ryer, cameraman. Yes. Ooh, you made it. Yes. <laughs> so glad. I didn't know if you were going to make it. Hey, Bri. Hey, good to see you, Ryer. Good to see you, Betty. Yes. The oldest little boy I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> That's right. I mean, it's past my bedtime. I got to go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dennis the Menace. All right, let's get into your battle of Heather Keith. Why yes. are you battling Heather Keith? You guys are friends. Uh, we are friends. I think, well, it's a win-win. I th I've, I've heard that the winner gets a penis. I don't know. Um, <laughs> the winner becomes a man. That was in the contract. Uh, so I'm excited. <laughs> I, I had the time for it. Thank you. Thank you, Michael J. Fox. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Your opponent is a champion here at Rose Battle. Make it loud for Miss Heather Keith. Yes. Hello. Yes. Uh, why are you doing to this uh, to this neurotic Jewish man here? Uh, <laughs> I actually requested the battle because we look like a female reboot of Superbad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, yeah, you're right. <laughs> yes. All right. So uh, who's going first here? It's one round. It's five jokes. Yeah, I can go first. You like this? You're into this? I'm into this. Folks, last battle of the might. Might. Last battle of the night. Let's make it so fucking loud we break this bitch. Battle! Battle! battle, battle Heather, right! Let's roll! All right. Ooh. All right. Everybody, give it up for Heather. Give it up for her. Yeah, she's great. Guys, she, I really, you know, I'm grateful Heather's here because she had to roll all the way from the pumpkin patch, and that is not close. <laughs> so thank you for coming. <laughs> Uh, Ryer looks like she's too shy to talk to her imaginary friend. <laughs> and you look like my imaginary friend. You're so lumpy. <laughs> Big tits. <laughs> Huge tits. He's chonkers, dude. Uh, uh, Heather looks like the Kardashian sister that we're not supposed to talk about. <laughs> No matter how much plastic surgery, you can't fix the retard. You can't fix it. You can't get that out, Heather. You can't. Uh, speaking of retard, I, uh, I asked Ryer what her favorite hobby was, and she went, oh, I like playing with a sham wow. <laughs> I play with it, and then I go, sham what? <laughs> yeah. Multi-purpose. I mean, that's, uh, use your money wisely. Hey, guys. Give it up for uh, Wizards of Savory Taste, everybody. Give it up for, Give it up for uh, So Heather's dad left when she was a kid to go to Thailand and find a wife. I think it's funny that she left, he left one lady boy to just go get another one, you know? Uh, uh, Ryer would never get molested uh, because if someone was like, hey, little boy, do you want a piece of candy? She would go, oh, no, thank you. I've already had 47 bubble gums. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I blow them up to look just like you. <laughs> oh. oh. So, so round, so pink. All right. Uh, uh, Heather told me that she was bisexual. But I don't know if that's true, because she also told me she lost her virginity in a ditch. And I think at that point, you just let anybody in the door. I mean, I don't know. Uh, Ryer actually told me she's a virgin, but that's just because her uncle Johnny said secrets don't count. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but it wasn't in a ditch, you white trash bitch. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's in a bed. It was in a, no, I was not molested. I have a lot of other things I was not molested. Uh, all right. Hey, everybody. Um... Uh, is this our last one, or we have two more? This last one. Last one. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, Heather was in an abusive relationship. It was really sad. For four years, and then she actually ended up having to move across the country so that he wouldn't come to her house anymore. And I said, Heather, you could have just stopped ordering from Domino's. <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't have come. Uh, Ryer told me she really likes listening to rap music. And I, when I asked her what her favorite song was, she went, oh, you know the one that goes, Reese's Buffs, Reese's Buffs. <laughs> he Heather just hates black people. That's how it is. You know that black little boy. He was <laughs> I'm right here. Guys, keep it going. Ryer Cameron and Heather Keith. Hell yeah. 
Hell yeah. You know what, let's start with, uh, with Alexis Fox. Who did you like on this episode of The L Word? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was a little confused, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so was Ryer. Uh, Always. <laughs> I can see. No. Uh, both were really great. Fuck. Um, you know, I'm going to go with Ryer on this one. Yeah. I thought she like, right. had some really good bangers. I really enjoyed it, and it was really fun. Nice. All right, uh, Matt, who'd you like in the San Francisco version of the last battle between Colin and... <laughs> and anyway, go ahead. Well, first of all, I just want to say, Ryer looks like if Dennis Leary was funny. <laughs> oh, you that's look, good. <laughs> uh, you look like you know who Dennis Leary is. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I really old. showed my age there. <laughs> so uh, but you know what? Fuck, dude. It was competitive. It was good. I'd give a little bit of the edge to Heather. I just thought that some of the, um, I, I, this is just my opinion, less is more. And I felt like Heather had a more subtle d delivery, you know? And I don't, I, it could have gone either way, but if I have to pick one tonight, I pick her. Um, and when uh, nobody's looking, I pick Ryer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Ryer looks like me up until age 25. <laughs> <laughs> uh. All right. Alexis Fox, who'd you like here? Did you like uh, Richie Rich or fucking Carmen San Diego, Carmen San Antonio, Carmen? Anyway, keep going. You already voted. This will be interesting. You want me to say it again? No, no. Oh, I already went to you, didn't I? I smoked a lot of weed before I got here. <laughs> Sorry about that. Did you want to ask me? Or you want yeah, to no. Alexis, who did you like in this one? Yes, great. Um, I really enjoyed Ryer in this one. No, okay. go ahead. Another yeah. vote for Ryer. Wow, okay. Uh, this was a great match. This was genuinely my, my favorite of the night because I could feel the love and yet you were still mean to each other, you know? You know, you definitely cared and you also wanted to hurt each other's feelings. That's what I like to see in a roast. Uh, Heather, you were doing great. I loved the impressions of Ryer, mm -hmm. but then when she shot back with I blow them up to look just <laughs> like you, that was a fatality for me. All right, so you, you like Ryer. Correct. Ooh. Oh, Ty, what are we doing? Are we going to overtime or? I felt like I was watching Ellen DeGeneres shit on her maid. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking for it. I was looking for it. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, it was like watching a teacher like be mean to her special needs student. <laughs> and which, I feel like that could go either way. <laughs> Rude. I mean, who booked uh, this battle? Make a wish. Um, the Trevor Project. <laughs> that could have been it, too. Yeah, these fucking lady fags. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, I don't know what my, like, uh, if it'll be tied if I don't, I don't pay attention to the other judges. Uh, no offense, I just don't listen. Uh, sorry, I'm very self absorbed. But uh, what's it called? Uh, Ryer with the comebacks. That got it for me. Like when she said not in the ditch and then also the blowing the bubble gum up. So for me, just based off of the comebacks, I would say that Ryer did. You guys are both great and I love both of you um, watching you roast. But Ryer got it for me. Wow, ladies and gentlemen, make it loud for your last winner of the night, Miss Ryer Cameron! Yeah.